Hello from Oslo. Since the beginning of the human time, every war had its spoil of war. The winners have always plundered the cities of the other countries of defeated armies, not only for gold or pieces, but also for wine. For example, stole the Prussian army 600 bottles of champagne in 1814. Nine wine wine. What is your wine emergency? When many pieces of art returned to their original countries after the war, the stolen good bottles of wine were never found again. All the stolen bottles have been drunk under ways and many times without any form for consideration. What a sad end for liquid treasuries. How many of these beautiful wines have been drunk by people without any form for humanity? The Nazis, for example, stole many bottles of wine in Bordeaux and Burgundy. Goering and Goebbels were very interested in wine and they drank some marvelous bottles as, as Richbourg 1929 and Latour 1928. I asked myself how a wine enthusiast could behave educated in front of a good bottle and be so brutal, uncivilized and bestial in front of human beings. During the summer of 1940, there were three wine importers from Bremen in Germany designed to import all wines from France. They received the title of Beauftrachter für den Wein Import aus Frankreich, a long and difficult name for the French who rebaptized them for Weinführer. Adolf Lechnitz was responsible for Burgundy, Otto Klebisch for the Champagne, and Heinz Bömers was in charge for Bordeaux. Around 312 million bottles have been exported from France to Germany from 1940 to 45. During the war, the French people were allowed to drink only two liters of wine a week per head, and later only for the men. They were even thinking about reducing it to one liter a week, but the Germans say no. They were afraid that such a bad decision could have had serious consequences among the French population. I can assure it was a good decision because the French can tolerate a lot but not a lack of wine. If everybody was enjoying a good glass of wine together, I'm sure there will be less problems on our beautiful planet. And as the great Ernest Hemingway said, wine is one of the most civilized things in the world. Until the next time, please remember to drink better wine more often, but less. If you like my video, please give me a like. If you got any question about the wine, please write it down under the video. Zum Wohl, Skoll!